Many in Plateau State, where the leadership of Operation Safe Heaven has organized a symposium for religious leaders in Plateau State to ensure peaceful coexistence among communities. The event is aimed at cautioning as well as drawing the attention of the leaders to desist from preaching sermons or messages that may incite the public. TVC News Plateau correspondent Funom Joshua filed the show. Selected clergymen from the Christian and Muslim faiths are seated in this hall. The leadership of the Operation Safe Heaven has invited them to a symposium on the need for them to prioritize preaching sermons and messages that promote unity, love, religious tolerance, and peaceful coexistence. It is believed that when preachers use their platform to vilify or demonize other faiths or groups, it foils religious or ethnic tensions which can lead to conflict and undermine peaceful coexistence. Religious leaders as trusted guides and moral authorities have a crucial role to play in this noble pursuit for peace. The sermons you deliver have a profound impact on the beliefs, attitude and the actions of your followers. A paper presentation on the subject matter was presented by two prominent religious leaders to the clergymen in attendance. The absence of religious tolerance has been a major factor responsible for violence, for violent religious conflicts experienced during the past two decades on the platform. All religious communities must educate their clergy on the need for religious harmony and the toleration of other faiths. A question and answer as well as commendation session were next for participants to understand areas deemed not clear on the subject matter. If anybody there's any assignment, don't hesitate to call me or call the general leader. We will get a thing and send it to you. If it means someone in death, call. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I have observed. Women are gradually being involved in conflicts and even criminal activities. We should ask for my prayer that God should force us to put what we have received today into practice. At the end of this symposium, it is agreed that any religious leader caught in the act of preaching sermons that are inciting will be arrested and face the law. Joshua, TVC News, Rukuba Cantonment.